Hello, okay, so my name is Sophia and today we are doing a little hair tutorial. I hope this helps and if it doesn't and you have any questions after watching this video, you're gonna have to ask someone above my pay grade because I don't work here. Here we go, let's get started. The most important thing that I do that is just a life changer, it honestly just saves lives left and right, is heat protectant. So here's heat protectant. I use the Red Ken, Red Ken, Big blowout, heat protecting, I'll link it. I put like a lot in. I don't know if, I don't know if a lot helps, um, but I, I, I put a lot in. I have a lot of hair though, so do what feels right. Um, it's your world, I'm just living in it. Really rake it on in there. Also, I washed my hair. <laughs> Obviously, that's why it's wet. The shampoo and conditioner I use, I don't think that really does anything for the blowout. Um, I use As I Am. Ugh, I'll just show you. I use, this is for like curly hair. Um, I have curly hair, believe it or not. As I am, restore and repair Jamaican black castor oil shampoo and conditioner. Now that we figured that out, I don't, I don't know if that's whatever. Quick blowout spray by Red Ken. This is what it looks like. I put so much of this in, it's probably unhealthy. But I actually had COVID um, back in the day and I still can't smell, but I smell that it smells like something. From what I can remember, <laughs> it smells good. I didn't realize how many products I used until filming this. Last but not least, Oliplex bonding oil. I feel like it's like everyone uses this. I can't smell it, but it smells good, I think. It used to smell good. I don't know, whatever. I can't smell. Sometimes I do like a hair mask like once a week as I am restore and repair um, Like co-wash not sure don't know what it does, but I know it makes my hair soft um, I leave it in for like at least an hour And I put I still like putting more in there's no such you know, there might be such thing as too much, but Not for me now. We're gonna start blow drying I section out my hair. I like section it out like this. Wait, I'll show you. So this is how I section it. It's a look. Uh, trust the process. Here we go. I take like a little section. This is like what it looks like. Okay, whatever. I don't know how it looks like in the back, but that has nothing to do with me. We're gonna take our little Revlon brush. We're gonna take our little piece that we want to do and we're gonna Take the brush and like really just really pull really hard. It should cause pain. Like it, if it doesn't hurt, you're not doing it right. Um, and then I just like really brush it through while it's on, of course. And then at the bottom, I like go like this and I really brush it through and then I like kind of spin it on this thing and then pull it out. All right, so here I'm gonna, now I'm gonna do it while it's on. You have to keep doing that part until it dries. Forgot to say that. Okay, it's not dry yet. Cool. <sighs> All right, cool, we did it. So it should look like this. If you're wondering, if you're wondering why I don't speed dry my hair, which means like you take your hair, I mean, it's kind of dry now, but like you take your hair and you take the blow dryer and you like dry it a little bit. I don't do that because my hair gets frizzy cause like, I don't know, it's curly, but I think if you have straight hair, you can do that. I don't know. Ask someone, ask a hairdresser, okay? I don't know what I'm doing.
one section is done. Okay, so I added a little more like wet hair and then we're gonna do the same thing. This isn't, this is a workout. I only, um, I only wash my hair. I don't wash my hair a lot. So this will last, this will last us a really long time. People are gonna be like, well, I don't know why I'm whispering. People are gonna be like, oh my God, she doesn't, she doesn't wash her hair. Yeah, she's so gross. Ah, uh, it's clean. You don't get it. The girls that get it, get it. And the girls that don't, don't. Anyway. And so just continue this forever until your arms start hurting, until you get hungry, um, until you are dehydrated. Just keep doing this. Okay. Also, if you think I'm wrong, I probably am wrong. Just don't listen to me. I don't work here, okay? Hairdressers are probably looking at this and like want to cry and roll over. They're like, what is she doing? I don't know what I'm doing either. So this is just what I do. And if you don't like it, then... I don't know, call the manager or something. Oh, also, I don't know how I do the back of my hair. I don't know, first of all, I, I don't look back there, so it doesn't really matter, right? For some reason it comes out fine. I think it's because I just like pull it so hard um, that it like causes hair loss and also it just is straight. Okay, and you see how it's getting frizzy? That's not good. That's not good at all. We don't like that. <sighs> okay, also, um, I don't know if this is what, I don't think other people do this. But I use this hairspray. It's the best hairspray for when you want to do your hair straight ever. It's Pureology Soft Spinach. Spinach. <sighs> See, I'm always hungry. Soft finish hairspray. Um, Pureology, the best of the best. At one time, actually, I liked it so much that like, and it smells so good. I can't smell because I had COVID. So like, I can't smell anymore. But um, back in the day, from what I can remember, it used to smell so good that I tried eating it and it didn't, don't, don't do that. And like rake it in there. I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> I'm starving. This takes a long time. Like the whole thing takes like an hour, I would say, or more. Um, I'm like hungry, but I'm going to finish this video first for you guys because I love you guys. Mmm, so good. I added some more wet hair. I know what you're thinking. The wet hair is touching the dry hair, so doesn't that ruin it? Yes. Ah, um, this is taking forever. Did I not put oil in my hair? I feel like I forgot to put oil in my hair. No, I could watch the instant replay, but... We're just gonna put some more oil in, or oil, if I didn't already. This is the oil, Olaplex bonding oil. Okay, now I'm kind of remembering that I did put it. If you don't have this, you're a loser. Mm -hmm. So what I said. Just kidding, I love you so much. Mm. So good. Yum. This is off topic. Correct me if I'm wrong, you know, I'm not a doctor. But I'm pretty sure you're supposed to eat like three times a day which is a full-time job.
Okay, and you're probably seeing a bunch of steam. I don't, that probably is a problem. There's nothing we can do about it. I'm hoping that it's the heat protectant that's like, no, I don't think it's my hair. I think my hair is fine. If you see steam and you're worried about it, just know that I see it too and I'm also worried about it. But here we go. All right, next section, we are almost done. Yes, this is a long process, I'm sorry, um, but here we go. Okay, and I like kind of do a middle part thing, but my hair has a mind of its own. It probably has its own social security number and a long-term boyfriend, unlike me. And so I basically just do a middle part and then like whatever happens, happens. And um, I get no decision in that. This is like the most important part, I think, because this is like the front of the hair. That's what all the boys are going to see. <laughs> I, I, I have no boys. Um... I almost cried. That's about it. Do more hairspray. Ugh. And I think that's, that's about it. Okay, I just did my whole goodbye ceremony and it totally wasn't recording. Just so awesome, love that. So I always put a little oil in and a little hairspray and um, yeah, I really hope this video helped. I hate saying goodbye, but I love you guys, goodbye. Hope this helped. If you have questions, DM me. Um, you're always more than welcome to DM me and I love you guys so much, goodbye.